Hey everybody, Sniper the Lazy Man here. Welcome back to The Walking Dead Season 1. So, we're back here. We shouldn't waste time. Hurry trying to figure out what to be done with Duck. I'm saying we shouldn't stay put. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. Gotcha. Fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. Please right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee. You'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest, so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Everything is fine. No, it's not. What are you doing? I'm putting him out of his misery. Oh. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben. Take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! Things are not turning out well. <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you? She could. She 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 just. Oh, oh, oh fuck! Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it.
Now, whether or not you liked Duck as a character, you have to admit, that's some pretty serious shit that we just saw. I'm actually more surprised that I'm not, like, even slightly tearing up at it. I don't know. Maybe it's just... I expect it, or... I don't know. But then again, I, I tear up every single time at the at one of the at the end the end scene of Kingdom Hearts, where Kyrie's back on Destiny Islands. I always tear up at that moment. So I don't know. There's a whole different. There's a whole different thing there. What Chuck said. What Chuck say? That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he did. I swear. Sorry. <laughs> Some sense into it. Don't be mad. Well, Chuck has no right to just say, "Yeah, you're going to turn into a walker." Hey, how you doing? I don't care what reason you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's going to end up dead. Because she is. I don't know much about you folks. I can tell you as sure as the sun's going to come up tomorrow. If y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't going to make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're going to find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plant, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Be safe up here. You betcha. All right. Kenny, you doing okay? It'll be good to get to the water. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. Doesn't matter a lick to me. Fuck. Just gotta move forward. All right. Good to know. Hey. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. See ya. Yeah. Hey, 
Clint? Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, I'm gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh... Tidy up a little, so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. Um, yeah. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? I know these are just bottles. But you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then? Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay. Let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah. Yes, yes you, you do. do. Excellent. Good shot. Aim oh, more to, to the, the right. right. Close. Now keep it steady. There you go. Nice. And round three. Elbows. There we go. I did it! Yeah, you did. Good job. I just pretended they were walker heads. Good. Just like you should. They're not walkers, though. No. Far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. Now, how about that hair? Hey, Clint. Hi. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? Are you saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. Do you remember when Andy <laughs> St. John grabbed it? And I got mad. Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't moan. It's a good thing. Do you know how to 
gonna do this? How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. Just now. <laughs> so you did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. Uh, I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. You're right. Before all of this, I was sent to jail, you know? Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with some. Here. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. <laughs> what did I say about moping? I don't want none of it. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what, we, uh, what else we gotta do. girl can shoot doesn't have to be pretty probably will be before too long where are you headed uh that way i mean when we get to savannah you got a few ideas we'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company you have any family out there somewhere been sort of on my own for the past oh, 14 years now Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. Be safe up here. You betcha. Well, actually, let's go back and uh, get that wine bottle. Or, pretty sure it's wine. I didn't realize this was, uh, I didn't realize you had to do this. Oh, whiskey. There we go. I did not realize you had to do this. It's a fifth of whiskey. But, all right. Seems fine with me. I found this there in you your go. package. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? Sure. Ooh. Not known for its finish. No kid. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some? Yeah. Yeah, that'd help. Mm. 
Okay, just snagged those. I knew it. <laughs> I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. Yeah, it is all your fault. Jesus, Ben. I know. They said they had my friend. That he was with just, them. Just stop. Even trust you. Yes. Why'd you have to go and tell me that? I just No, just don't tell anybody. You can't take any of it back, so don't. Okay. <laughs> What's how I am right now? Uh twenty one fifty something. Yeah, that seems good. So, um, next time, uh, we'll, uh, show Clem the, uh, map that we took, and, uh, see what she has to say. So, for Lee and Clementine, we will see you all next time.